his status as he got a chance in the midfield last year and now yeah, really blossoming. Omira though with the entry kick. Sending Hawthorne forward O'Brien. Clever. Bruce did his best to kick this. He was at his best. That's a footwork from Anderson initially. The handball from Higgins misses the mark. And someone provides some spark. Caden bursts through. Pollock had to find that left side again and he found it sweetly. And was able to guide the ball nice and low. His centering ball is going to ask Goldstein to fly. He wasn't quite sure whether to mark or spoil. O'Brien, Marnie, threads the handball through. Hard going in there. Goldie still on the first. Marnie, good determination. Oh, three times yeah. for Marnie. Great effort. Out to Aaron Hall, who can kick a ball. And he shows that. And the Kangaroos live for their second. And then tried to keep the flow and the momentum going. Atley, wall one from O'Meara. Now Anderson loves the crash Ooh. and bash. No free kick. So it's all fair in love and war. Yeah. Second initially, and then Sherry and each handball are getting closer to the boundary line. Scully bounces up well, uses shields, they've chained the handball well. 20 seconds against the clock, the Hawks doubling back Gunston. That's the target. Can he get up and mark? It's deep, ends up with O'Brien who kicked the goal. Slightly interfered with Henderson went for a cute pass, maybe not the time or the place. Bruce to Scully, he did too, didn't blast away. It was a bit of a middling kick. Oh, Burgoyne, give him an opportunity like that, and he'll gobble it up. Finds Aaron Hall, it's not an easy one to grab. Zebel flew wholehearted as he always did, and on the spillage, Anderson Harwick not letting him out of his sight. Well, the young man Sherry hasn't really been able to get himself involved in the contest at all either. So you're playing he and Brown in your forward half of the ground without any impact. And the pressure applied by the Hawks and North can't get out. They can get in. So the last two goals have come from turnovers. Yeah, clean break out of the middle here. Quick handoff and as much on the kick as possible from Higgins. Ben Brown left. Oh, oh he's got it, has he? He has. Jeez. Big tap down. Higgins onto it first, though. North out of the middle, bursting. Williams's kick is well placed to Anderson. He'll look in the inside. Simpkin kept on running. Brown's on the move. It's 50. Well, the good news for North Melbourne fans is that all of a sudden Ben Brown found some space to work into and put 10 metres on James Frawley. Now Alistair Clarkson is fuming. <laughs> Trying to do just that. There's too much on the kick. They put Atley in all sorts of strife. Now Henderson decided to handball to Gunston, running away from goal. They try and sort it out through Hanrahan. Tarrant the cruel bounce. Then he put a big tackle on Mitchell Lewis. Free Did kick. he have the footy? He didn't. Free kick, Lewis. High ball for Brown and McAvoy. Brown went hard at the ball. Scully came through the pack. Crunch! Because he had a couple there to link up by hand. Pretty smart from Lewis, but. Oh, oh Donald just took him out. Good hit. Back along the wing, Strat and climb high again from this young man, oh, Kevin Taylor. Shields, oh, there's a setup. Oh, Sissel has to be careful there. Uh, they're right. hanging on by their fingernails here, the yeah. roof. Sicily on the reload. Oh, Lewis looked likely. Atlee's got some problems here. Spits out. Liam Shields, he's going to go on his own, off the left oh. boot! A little bit of overlap and flow here, can it amount to anything? Walker has to charge through and hope for the best. Went straight into a forest of trees and there was hawks everywhere. They're swarming forward now to make them pay. Scully sets up Wingard. Couple of high draft picks there doing their thing. And the Hawks are getting close to being home. Little opportunity here. Now it's going to be a free kick to Sherry. For his first goal in AFL footy. He's nursed it, but it's got there. And a cause for celebration. Tristan Sherry puts it through. Well, the body language says it all for the North Melbourne skipper, Hutto. Jack Siebel just sitting by himself at the moment on the boundary. Uh, slumped, disappointed. He's out of the game because of a um, left hamstring injury. Free kick to Goldstein. 
Can they get something going late? Oh, this time over the top. Thomas takes the mark, but it's a free kick to Ben Brown, I think. This is a secret. Pitta, good hands, moved it to Jamont. One more. Now, Taylor with the setup. Deep to full forward. Waiting underneath it. Zuha! <laughs> Three minutes and nine seconds on the clock. Segler disposed of Goldstein. Higgins the handoff. Thomas the snap. Oh, the the snap! Oh, come on! Three minutes to go. Clarko can't believe it. No one can. Hit the phones. Well, he's likely to get it, Ben Brown. He's, he's, he'd have to be the one. He's the target, all right. And here he... No, yes, he wasn't <laughs> sure whether to go for it. Taylor takes the mark. What's going through his head right now? A goal and scores a tied up. This for five in a row. Oh, it's high. It's markable. Underneath of Thomas Higgins, oh. Simpkin. Oh. 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 oh, that's the game. Or is it? Oh, I they had a scare. Well, how's your hearts, Hawk fans? You've got home, but only just.